massive fan actually. Um, it was it PlayStation? Was it PlayStation? Yeah. Um, I used to actually sit in my room and actually get quite scared. And every, I think everybody at one point attached a long plait to their hair and whipped it around <laughs> before Beyonce was doing it um, and pretended you were jumping bed from bed from cave to cave. And yeah, it's a little bit of a dream actually. And I'm really excited to be a part of it. Um, I think it's because you know she's kind of put in a situation where she has to be. She has to be this really strong woman and, and there's a lot of things around her that don't believe in her and she just kind of has to take on the role to be this kick-ass girl and she goes on her own sort of personal journey and um, the stuff she goes through, I mean, it, it's really empowering and it's really um, really amazing and I, I love the way she's done it this time because um, it's really real and it's really endearing and it's really powerful. So. Um, for me, it's, it's great to watch. Well, for once, she's so tiny and so sweet and so lovely and humble. Um, so for her, you know, I stepped on the job for four days. She was doing it for months and months, and she just still had great enthusiasm. Um, she must have been mentally exhausted, you know, but um, she smashed it. She completely smashed it. She took the ball by the horns and she smashed it, and it was really great to watch. It is a roller coaster. I think it's, it, yeah, you, you definitely don't get, um, get bored that's for sure it keeps you on your toes on the edge of your seat um i mean what's not to love tara you know she's she's amazing she's mega babe as well so you know what's not to love there